Hello everyone, good morning. Today is Monday, 8th July 2024. This is Daily Feed Devotional Guide for Young Minds. I hope you had a blissful night rest. God bless you. Before we proceed, let us pray. Our Father, our God, thank you, Lord, for protecting us over night. Thank you, Lord, because it is by your grace and by your will that we are alive up to this present moment. Thank you, Lord, for shielding us, for protecting us, for covering us. Hallelujah be to your holy name, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for you are the lifter of our heads. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. Amen. So this morning, we shall be considering God is our shield as our topic. God is our shield. We have our Bible text taken from the book of Psalms, Psalms chapter 28 verses 1 to 9. And um, her memory verse is from Psalms chapter 3 verse 3, which says, and I read, But thou, O Lord, art a shield for me, my glory and the lifter of my head. Praise Jesus. God is our shield. He is always there to protect and shield us from all evil. Amen. But the question is, are you ready to dwell under his shadow for him to shield you? Are you ready to dwell under his shadow for him to shield you? Are you? When you go out and come in safely, it is not by you. It is God who shielded you from evil that could have happened on your way of either going in or coming out. It is just him alone. God is our shield. In the Bible, you know, the Bible mentioned many people that God shielded. People like the Israelites. God is our shield. Just abide in him for you to experience the divine protection. Man cannot protect you. Never. They, they will even deceive you. In the same vein, charm can never save you. If you depend on charm, or you, if you heard from someone who are, oh, if you use this kind of charm, don't worry, you should just have to be rest assured. Well, I want to say to you this morning that it is just a lie from the pit of hell. They are all lies. It is holy God that can save you. Because God is the shield that you need. God is the shield that everyone needs. Amen. You can call on God to shield you. From those who are trying to kill you. And when you call on God, just trust and believe he will answer you. Isaiah chapter 31 verse 5. Verse 5 confirmed that. Praise God. Trust in God to save you from evil. Even if someone tries to kidnap you. God will just call on God and God will shield you. To the point that the person will never touch you nor harm you. God shields his children. If you want to enjoy the protection of God, you just have to be his child. Just be his child. Live for him and stay away from things that doesn't bring glory to his name. He values his name. God is our great shield. The reason why we are alive in good condition is because of God. Because he watches over us and guards us from evil and bad circumstances. But if you do not want to be in trouble and you want to experience the safety and protection children of God are experiencing, do things that please God. I say to you this morning, do things that please God. Declare to yourself like this, I am protected and watched by God. I am not afraid. God is my shield. Repeat after me again. I am watched and protected by God. I am not afraid. God is my shield. And I pray as you have confessed and as, as you have declared, God will always be your shield. He will never shame you in the name of Jesus. Our scriptural truth this morning is the Lord is our shield from every danger. Say to yourself, the Lord is my shield from every danger. Amen. Prayer point. Pray with me. Father, help me to always stay with you and not far from you so that I can enjoy your protection 
in Jesus' name. Father, help me to always stay with you and not far from you so that I can enjoy your protection in the name of Jesus. Let's pray. Our God and our Father, we thank you, Lord, for how far you've helped us, for how far you've been shielding us, you've shielded us, and because you still be shielding us, thank you, Lord Jesus. All our Father, we pray unto your holy name. God, please help us to stay close with you. Help us not to be far away from you. You are the lifter of our heads. Continue to be so, Lord. Father, we pray, let us enjoy the divine protection you have for your children and deliver us always from trouble. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Good morning. Have a blissful week. Have a blessed week. May this week be fruitful. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Don't forget, God is our shield this week and beyond. See you next time.